Hey there, this is Tyler from WTFX. Today we're focusing on a couple blurs. Well, not really. Okay, th these aren't blurs, but they're grouped with them. I don't know why, but I either way, there, there are subtle differences between them, so let, let's just look at them. The sharpen effect and unsharp mask effect. They're not actually blurs, but are grouped with them. And these two effects help to sharpen an image, basically eradicating blurs altogether. They're like blur terminators. Or blurminators. Come with me if you want not to be blurred. The sharpen effect, as mentioned earlier, helps to eliminate blurs by detecting an object's edge. It does this by finding its highlights and shadows. Adjusting the amount either increases or decreases how sharp the image gets. Now, the unsharp mask effect. The unsharp mask effect is to sharpen as a cheeseburger is an unhamburger. They are both basically the same thing. It's just one comes with a little something extra. Unsharp mask effect does give you a little more control for subtlety. Increasing the radius will change how sharp the edges get. If you don't like how sharp the edges are, bring up the threshold to help even everything out. Adjusting the amount will control how much of the image becomes sharpened. So whether you like being able to control the subtlety of the unsharp mask effect or the efficient speed, you know, this is just stupid. They're not blurs. Who cares? Just, thanks for watching. I need a